Hi, how are you? Nice to see you. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Con mucho calor. En serio. Está haciendo algo de calorcito. Oh, I thought it was going to rain today, but it didn't. Hopefully it rains later on. Bueno, que no hay, no hay, no hay señales. It's a little cloudy. Rain probably tomorrow, but not today. Okay, so well, yeah, it will be a little hot tonight. Let's expect that tomorrow the weather is better, right? What temperature are we in now? Let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, clear, mostly clear, partly cloudy, no, not rain for today, chicos. So it's going to be clear, apparently, all night and no rain. Imagine. Imagine. Bueno. Bueno. Vamos a ver. Hi, hi. Bravo four. Nice. Nice, nice. I'm going to get the list. And then we will check at the end of Okay, bueno. Tell me present, Carlos. Present, teacher. How are you, Carlos? Fine. Okay. Is Cecilia del Carmen? Present, Miss. Okay. Eh, Clarissa. Clarissa. Claudia Ivo. Present, teacher. Clarissa. No. Cecilia, present. Um, Daniel Eduardo. Present teacher. Erika Joana. Present teacher. Isaia Santana. Present. Ah. And this Iván, 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 
Jonathan. Jorge. Present teacher. Juan Antonio. Juan Antonio. Karen Leticia. Luis Enrique. Manuel Antonio. Rosibel. Present teacher. Sí, Sandra. Sandra Elizabeth. Silvia Estela. Silvia Inés. Present teacher. Hi, Silvia. Good well, evening. Uh, hi, good evening. Vaya, vamos a ver los que no me dijeron present. Clarissa. Iván. Yvette. Jonathan, Juan Antonio, Karen, Luis Enrique, Present, Miss. Manuel, Manuel, Manuel no here, uh, Sandra Elizabeth, Silvia Estela. Okay. Bueno, de Today uh, we are going to talk about could. That's could. That's the model we are going to be covering today. Okay, by Sean. And the topic today is how to use could, right? And we are on our video conference number 17, tomorrow 18, Wednesday 19, and we finish on Thursday, right? Thursday. Remember that you have a date, a specific date for papers, right? So remember in your companies, if they have sent, if they haven't sent the documents yet, right? Remind them, remind them because the time is, is getting to the end. So be sure that you present the documents on time. Okay, well, our objective by the end of this lesson, uh, participants, will be able to use good, right? So how do we use good? We're going to see that later on. I have a couple of questions for you. How often do you ask for permission? And what is the request or what is the procedure to request for a permission? How often do you ask for permission? And what is the procedure? I'm going to send you to the groups right now. So you share with your partners, you give, remember this is about you, right? This is about you. So you are free to share with your partners. I'm going to make only three groups right now because you're only 10. Well, join, join, join. Join the rooms. And discuss the questions. I'm going to send the questions there in the chat. Larissa, ¿Qué tenemos que hacer, compañeros? Discuss the questions. Discuss the questions. Permítanme. Hay 
Ajá. Ah, unidad 4. 4, 5, 9. No, el módulo 5. <ríe> el manual del módulo 5 estoy buscando. Ah, ok. I pasted the questions in the chat. Ok. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. So you can see them in the chat. Ok, ahorita. The questions are in the WhatsApp chat, chicos. Hello, Jorge, Daniel, Isaías, are you here? Yes, teacher. Okay, please, then let's discuss the questions. Hola, teacher. Hi, Silvia. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> teacher, ahorita creo que estamos en un grupo, ¿verdad? You were. O solo tres personas. Porque solo tres personas veo conectados. Estábamos en un grupo, pero nos regresó a la sala principal. Sí, los regresé porque no hablan. Miren, el propósito, chicos, de mandarlos a un grupo es que hablen. Este es, este es algo personal. Es algo personal para lo que los... Por eso los mandé a grupo, porque es información que ustedes conocen, porque es suya. ¿verdad? Es suya, no es del manual, es suya. Lo voy a recambiar los grupos, espero que funcionen los nuevos grupos. Las preguntas se las he mandado al chat de WhatsApp. Por favor, actívense. Ok. Solo te voy manejando. Sí, Silvita, pero solo usted va manejando, los demás están ahí. Pues, actívense, actívense. Ok. Los necesito más usos. ¿De acuerdo? Vaya, vale, let's begin. Join. Join the group and activate. Teacher, no logré unirme. Ya vamos a ver. ¿No le aparece el grupo número dos por ahí? Eh, eh, no. A bien, tenía usted ahí. Vaya. <ríe> Shala, halo. Vamos a ver. Si lo Hoy, sí. Hoy sí me aparece. Excelente. El grupo número uno. Sí. Sandra, hello. Vamos, chicos. Iván, try to connect. Manuel, hello. Me han dejado bien pobre ese grupo dos de cinco gentes que he mandado. Try to join. Pensaba pedir uno mañana. Uh, sería cada cuánto. La verdad, yo no pido. You hardly ever ask for permission. I have, no, I never, I never. 
I never get ask, ask for permission. I never ask for ask ask for mm -hmm, for permission. In my case, I try to ask permission, but in my case, that's it. Mm. Permission for sick or something like that? No, but I ask my day off. Uh -huh. um, and once a month, I ask for, for my day off. But for permission for something like sick or I had to do something. Because they hungry. <laughs> and what is the procedure to request one? First, I asked to my boss if I can to ask one day. Then she passed me a a document that I had to fill inside. And this, this is all. I, I almost I never ask, ask, ask. Me. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's very dangerous to ask permission. Yeah, it's very dangerous. No, no control, no medical control. No. Teacher, in, in, in ask for, for permission once a, a month for medical control is, is correct. Yes, yes, that would be correct. In my case, is For checking. <laughs> yeah, for checking. Checking. <laughs> In my company, is it's very dangerous uh, us uh, for permission uh, because uh, my boss and uh, fire. Uh, <laughs> we really send, yes, me only, only person healthy needed. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> yeah. oh. But you have My the partner. right. You have the right to ask for permission to go to the doctor. Yeah. Uh, My necessary. Yeah, but uh, the the form to um, ¿Cómo se dice? Incapacitar. Es decir, ya llega con la incapacidad, pero que fueron a pasar consulta rara vez. To get a sick leave. Ah, okay. And uh, there I there are uh, sometimes uh, when uh, is emergency by accident on motorcycle. In this case, uh, no problem. It's a bad company. What do you mean by no problem? Uh, because the uh, employee is uh, uh, out or como se dice faith, quiero ver. Ah, porque ya está fuera de servicio. Mm -hmm. When they Entonces, home, you service, service. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No, but you mean they are out when they are going home, not when they are visiting clients in their motorcycle. Mm -hmm. Because if they have an accident while they are visiting a client during working time, they are not out of service, they are working. Mm -hmm. Eh, lo que sucede, Miss, es que se hizo en, en el pasado mal uso de... de, de... En el pasado. Ajá. Y la policía 
policies uh, was uh, hard. What happens when somebody has an accident in the motorcycle? No se le escucha, Miss. My question is, what happens if somebody has an accident in the motorcycle? Uh, in this case, no problem. But what do but, you mean by no problem? Uh, for uh, common sick is the problem, but if the uh, is my partner uh, how the accident in the motorcycle, then uh, that will be valid. Yeah. Okay. But if somebody has flu, they go to work with the flu. Yes, uh, we work with the flu. Wow. And what about if you make other people get sick too? Mm. No problem. <laughs> yeah. no it's problem. a big it's a big problem, but uh, okay, so not for I don't see. <laughs> <laughs> For the employee, but not for the company. It's there, I don't see. Uh -huh. It's there, I don't see. Imagine what a pro, what is that term? It's like a maquila, right? Yeah. Uh, um, so, so. My God. Es que, es que lo que sucede es que se hizo mal uso de, de las incapacidades. Eh, Ahora, queda muy a criterio del jefe eh, determinar de si está enfermo o no. En algunos casos sí, pero que eh, de repente decían estar enfermos y las redes sociales los, eh, los, los evidencian. Sí, los delataban. Mm. Vale. Pero no estaba nadie de la oficina en las redes sociales. Uh, uh -huh. Exactly. That's why. Uh -huh. yeah, WhatsApp nada. <laughs> Todo bloqueado en el estado. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. So next time, don't add anybody from the company. Change the name. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. No, that's so sad. That's so sad. It's, it's well, so sad. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So what are the procedures? In my you? case, uh... with you, uh -huh. teacher. Anybody here? Hello. No veo a nadie. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> sí. I can I can hear you, but I cannot see you. Teacher. Ah, okay. Now I see you. So like, where? <laughs> uh -huh, tell me. Solo una una consulta. Eh, um, autorización. ¿Cómo se se pronuncia? Uh, autorization. Autorization. Yeah. Okay. An autorization. What's the procedure? In my case, teacher, I send an email. Okay. In my case, the process is to put an AP in the system to my boss. And then um, he gives me the authorization. So, but you have to show uh, something that you went to a doctor? Or you only say, I feel sick and you stay home?
Do you have to go to the doctor? Is it mandatory to go to the doctor when you're sick? Hello? Hello, teacher. Did you listen to my question? Imagine you feel sick. Is it mandatory for you to go to the doctor? Or you can just stay home and rest? Yes. Yes. Hmm? I go to the doctor. You have to go to the doctor. Okay. What happens if you don't go to the doctor? Okay, coming back. Hello, teacher. Good evening. See how many are back? Ten. We're missing a couple of people. Okay, a ver, how, do you, how often do you ask for permission? Do you ask for permission often or not much? In my case, often. Often? Yeah. Not too often. No. Okay. In my case, rarely. Okay. What about the others? Are you I hardly ever ask. Very responsible work and working people. Okay. <clears throat> Do you know the procedure for requesting a permission? I always have problem with that procedure because as I ask for permission, like whoa, far, 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 eh, like once a year, the next time. Oh. The next time I will need a permission, I have to be asking, right, what to do. Because I prefer, when I have an appointment with the doctor, I prefer to make it in my time, in my free time, knowing working time, right? Just when there is no way, I do it in, in working time, but uh -huh. That's why it, sometimes the procedures, we may tend to forget them, right? Okay, let's go on here. Remember last class, we were talking about should and shouldn't. We said we use should and shouldn't to give advice, right? And that means when you say you should do this, that means it is a good idea <coughs> for you to do it. And if you say you shouldn't, that means it is mm, a bad idea for you to do it. Okay? <coughs> now, as I told you, today we are going to be using could. Let's look at the conversation. Good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Hello, Hank. I'm okay, but Betty is not. Really? What's wrong, Betty? Well, my mother is sick and my sister can't go to can go see her tomorrow. I'm sorry to hear that. You could ask for permission. He's right. You could go to Human Resources Department and request a form. Could I mention the reason for the permission? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, now let's read together. Good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Hello, hi. I'm okay, but there is not. Really? What's wrong, Betty? Well, my mother is sick and my sister can't go see her tomorrow. I'm sorry to hear that. You could ask for permission. 
his right, you could go to Human Resources Department and request a form. Would I mention the reason for the permission? <coughs> yes, absolutely. Okay, you are in your manual. You are in your manual, page 41. You're going to go to the groups, practice the conversation. 40, 41 del, uh, del, del manual, teacher. Yes, 41. Ahí va a disculpar, teacher, que estaba un problema con Zoom, no podía de entrar. Okay. Estaba tratando de entrar, por eso me tardé un poco. Okay. Ahí le escribí al WhatsApp, al, al grupo de WhatsApp. Ah, va, ya lo vamos a ver, claro. Al chat, sí, al chat quiero decir. Sí. Ahí me va a disculpar. Sí. <coughs> You're going to go practice the conversation. No, don't see the answers. <laughs> Wait. So go practice the conversation and then answer the questions, okay? What is the problem with Betty? Do you know someone who has a similar situation? And then you share with your kind. So first, go practice the conversation, right? Page 41 in your manual. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? We are practice the conversation practice the answer conversation. the right. exercise three. Exactly. Two questions. You go practice the conversation and then practice answer the conversation. The and answer the questions in exercise three. There we go. I'm going to make other groups. Now we can add one more. Yes. Nice. Nice, nice. Now we have four groups in each. Remember, practice, okay, change roles, change partner, read again, and then you answer the questions. Practice pronunciation here. Go, 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 go. Try to join. If you have any problems, let me know so I can move you. Juan Antonio, Iván. Hi, hi. Hi, hi, teacher. Hi, hi. Sí, con esta Rosy, yo no sé si Isaías está trabajando porque no contestó. No, no contestó. Isaías, hello. Hello, teacher. Are you here, Isaías? Yes, yes. I just count on you. Okay. Go ahead. Procedural practice. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Uh, me and you, Judy. Okay. Good, good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Hello, Han. I am okay, but Betty is Betty. not. Betty is not. Really? What's wrong, Betty? Um. Well, my mother is sick, and my sister can go see her tomorrow. I'm sorry to hear that. You could ask for permission. He's right. You could go to HR department and request a form. Continue, Julie. Okay. Could, could I mention the reason for the permission? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Chain. Good morning, ladies. 
How are you doing today? Hello, Ham. I'm okay. But Betty is not. Really? What's wrong, Betty? Betty? Well, my mother is sick. And my sister can go see her tomorrow. I am sorry to hear that you could ask for permission. He's right. You could go to HR department and request a form. Who and mention this for the permission? Absolutely. 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 Isaías, Corres Iber. ¿Quién empieza? Solo tres, a ver. Sí. Ah, no, está la teacher. Yo. <ríe> Vamos, Chaya. Eran cuatro, pero como que el otro no logró entrar, ¿eh? Uh, yeah. Yes, I'm right. Good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Uh, hello, Hank. I am okay. But Betty is not. Really? What's growing, Betty? Well, my mother is sick and my sister can go see her tomorrow. I am sorry to hear that you call Hank for permission. He's right. You could go to HR department and request a form. Human resources. Como se dice? Human resources. Ah, uh, human. That's the human resources. Can see. Oh, what is wrong? Hola. Ahí es que ahí continúa Julie, lo que usted llevaba. Julie, dos veces. Ay, sí, es cierto. Ay, good. I mentioned for reason. For the permission. Yes, I can. Oh, inicio yo. Good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Hello, Han. I am okay, but Betty has not. Really? But wrong, Betty? Well, my mother is sick. I, my sister, can go to her tomorrow. I am sorry to hear that. You ask for permission. He is right. You call, go to a chair, no second, the bottom, and request the human resources. Human resources. Human resources. Human resources. Request. Call I make you the resume for the permission. Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Absolutely. Silvia, do you know someone who had a similar situation? Yes. Um, ahorita estoy tratando de complementar ahí en el, el book. Las did respuestas. You, did you finish the conversation? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. Do you know someone who had a similar situation? In my case, I don't. I don't know someone who had a similar situation. You don't? No, I don't. Okay. Yes. Este, voy a ingresar por medio de la compu. Me reenvía a este grupo, porfa. Me voy okay. a hacer el teléfono, me llega a la casa. Let's shut. 
Este es el nombre. Nombre, creo que. Sí. El nombre. Hello, hello. Hello. Ay, Ay sí, sí. <ríe> Aquí estoy. Miren, yo le escribí ahora, me reconoció que era yo. Sí. <ríe> le puse Ceci. Ah. <risa> Solo una Ceci tiene su grupo. Mm, mm, quiero ver, no. Bueno, en este grupo sí. Ah, ok. <risa> Vamos a practicar la conversación, ¿verdad? Yes. Eh, bueno, no sé. ya tengo ¿Qué la tiene? Por igual. Ah. Por igual. Ah. Ahorita voy a ver. En el módulo 5, ¿la cuál es? Por igual. Dice. Por igual, por igual, the last unit. Ahorita abro el módulo, permítanme. Mm, me quedó pobre un grupo. No, no me vaya a jalar, tiche, porque ahorita... <risa> Aquel día me, me, me mandó para otro grupo y ahí... <risa> no, no, están entre tres y cuatro, so that's okay. Ok. <risa> Cierto, la vez pasada a comenzar a hablar y cuando... ¡pum! Ajá. Es que Rosy estaba solita. Ah. Pero me la llevo. Rosy está aquí. No. No, no she's in another group. Vaya, espérenme. Ahorita estoy buscando lo del módulo para compartirlo. Dice por igual. Eh. Ya, mis, ya hice todas las tareas. Hasta el es, examen. Eso, Verina. Bárbara. Muy bien. No nos copia. Me costó sí. tanto, pero es que la hice con la mente fresca el sábado y domingo. Ay, sí, así está. toca. Así sí, porque el, do, el, el día de semana no, no le entiendo nada de, ya del, del cansancio. <risa> es que a veces me toca pesado en el trabajo. Sí. So you need to take advantage of Mis no le encuentro. Ah. Espérenme. Oh, creo que voy muy lejos todavía. Por igual. Uh -huh. ¿Cuánto tiempo nos va a dar, mis? Unos tres minutos más. ¿Cuánto? Unos tres minutos más. <risa> Se me va. <risa> Denos cinco. Vaya, pues. Para igual tu guillo. Vamos. Me no encuentro la página todavía, todavía voy en la 30 y quiero ver 30 y 34, güey. Pero me... uh -huh. 38, 39, 40, llega a 40, 41. Ahí está. Okay. <risa> Bye. Bye. Ahorita comparto, ahorita. Now you're ready. Bye. No sé, me dice si se logra ver. ¿Se logra ver? Sí. Bye. Yes. ¿Quién empieza? Dale, le voy a apoyar yo. Bye. Voy a hacer yo el segundo. Good morning, lady. How are you doing today? Hello, Han. I am okay, but Betty is not. Ready. What's wrong, Betty? Well, my mother is sick and my sister can go see her tomorrow. I'm sorry to hear that. You would ask permission. For permission. He is right. You go go to a uh, H L F the human resources human resources department department in request a for. Well, I mentioned the reason for the permission. Yes, absolutely. ¿Cómo se pronuncia, teacher? Absolutely. 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 
Inicia. Ok. Va a practicar Silvia y Erika, creo que está verdad. Ya está, si sí, solo usted faltaba. Ah, ya no estuvo, preocupes. solo le esperábamos a usted. Ah, vaya, Así entonces que hágalo de los dos lados. Uh -huh. <ríe> Good morning, ladies. How are you do doing today? Hello, Hank. I'm okay. But Barry is not. Uh, really? What's wrong, Barry? Well, my mother is six. And my sister can't go see her tomorrow. I am sorry to hear that you called us for permission. He is right. You would go. ¿Qué dijo que eran esas iniciales? Human resources. Human, Human resources. Department. Human resources department and request a form. Oh, I mentioned to the reason that. Riz, ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Re, Riz, 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 Dile, siga. Bye. Uh, good morning, ladies. How are you doing today? Hello, Hank. I am okay, but Barry is not. Uh, really? What's going on, Barry? Well, my mother is six, and my sister can't. Go see her tomorrow. I am sorry to hear that uh, you call has for permission. He is right. You will go to human res human resource department and request a form. Uh, call a mix a mention a reason uh, for the permission. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. But now you can go for the questions. Did you answer the questions already? Yes. So, so un poquito más la página. Ahí abajo están otras preguntas. Abajo, Daniel. Esas, esas, esas. Right. esas. Okay. What is the problem with Betty? What is the problem with Betty? What is the problem with Betty? Her mother is sick. Problem with Betty. No, there is. The mother is six. six. Sister. And her sister can go to, to see her. Ah, contestamos ahí. Sí. Sí. Quiero ver. ¿Cuál era? Dijimos el problema con Betty es que. In English, the problem is. Que la que en Ghost. Ah, her mother is sick. Quiero My mother is sick and my sister no, her mother. Her mother is sick. Entonces tendría que ser que la mamá y la hermana no quieren ir mañana. No, quieren no ir. that her mother is sick and her sister can no go see her. Okay, can you tell you? But the problem is her mother is sick. Ah, pero, pero, bueno, voy a escribir pues ahorita. Her, the problem is that her mother is sick. The problem is my mother. No, her mother. Her mother is sick, no your mother. Ni Dios lo quiere. Así. 
her mother. Her mother. Uh -huh. Is sick. Sí. Uh -huh. Ok. Entonces la vamos a poner acá. Va. Y la otra dice. Do you know someone who a, a similar situation? In no, someone in a similar situation? No, I don't. Okay. Así voy a poner el punto. No, I don't. No. 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 Así, ¿verdad? Ahí, ahí, ahí. Ahí. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hi. You're done, right? Bueno, let's go. Yes. Yes. Are there any mosquitoes in your house? Mosquitoes? No mosquitos, sino que son. Yes. A lot of. Los zancudos. Ay, un grato. Me han picado la espalda. En los zancudos, la ticha. <laughs> zancudos. Zancudos son mos... We say mosquitos. Son varios, vea. Sí. Mosquitos in English, but in Spanish, zancudos, right? Uh, Los mosquitos. Vaya, vamos a ver. Let's go check. Ahí está. A ver, number one, what's the problem with Betty? Her mother is sick. Mother is sick. Her mother. Her mother is sister is sick. Um, she has sister, right? Yes. Um, what happens with her, her sister? sister can go see her to her mother the next uh -huh. day. And she needs a permission. She needs a permission to go see her. Nice. Do you know someone who had a situation like that? No, I don't know. No? No. No, teacher. No, I don't, I don't know. Nobody, nobody, nobody. Que <laughs> galán. Yeah, because imagine having the mother sick is not. Mm, mm, nothing good. Okay. Bueno. Bueno, bueno. Let's move here. Check her mother is sick and she needs to go see her. And the other. Oh, y por qué no sé. Por qué no. Bueno, okay. No se puede ver la otra. Okay. Check. Today eh, we're talking about could. When do we use could? says we use could for present and future, right? Present and future. It can, can and may are used to give permission. May I go, may I go out, you say, right? May I go out? Can I go out? May is more formal and less common in everyday context. So that's why we use we tend to use me. You can borrow my car if you want, informal. Children may use the pool with adults to permission. Those are uh, permissions for present and future, right? 
we can also uh, use could when we want to ask for permission and look at the examples. Could I open the door? Could I leave early today? Would I be absent tomorrow? But here trying to be more formal, right? If you want to be more formal, you use could. Could I leave early today? Instead of saying, can I leave early? Because you think that your boss may say no. If you say, eh, boss, can I leave early today? So like, mm. right? But if you say, could I leave early today? So probably they say, mm, okay, why? <laughs> right? So there must be a possibility. So remember, we use could if we want to be formal. More formal, more polite. Would I be absent tomorrow? Could I means like, is it possible? Is there a possibility that I be absent tomorrow? Right? So you are more formal. Instead of saying can or may, uh, you use could for permissions. Now check. Can, could, and may are used to ask for permission, right? We said that already. Can Miss, is the most direct of the three. Tell me, Luis. I mean, uh, can is informal. Yeah. Uh, could is formal and may is polite. Um, could is formal and polite. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. The most common we will say is may, right? But you use can only when you are very close to the person you're asking for permission. If you're okay. very close, you use can. Hey, can I go out? Can I use your cell phone? Can I watch your television? But if the person is very close to you, if mm -mm, no, if no, no, then you ask may. May is more formal than can, but could okay. is even more formal. Right? Okay. If you want to be very direct, you use can. But remember, you use can to ask for permission only if you are very close to the person. So you know the person very well, so that it lets you be very informed. Right? Okay. If okay. not, use may. If you want to be extremely formal, use could. Yeah? Okay, Miss uh, Can I use your phone? Would I have a glass of water? May I start my presentation? Right? So, which is the most formal? Me. But could is much more formal than can. Could is, for example, when you say, um, I want to ask for permission. I want to be formal and polite. Mm. And there is a big possibility that I could receive a negative answer. So I better try to be more formal. Right? Because I want to get a good answer, a positive answer. Now, let's move. When we talk about permission, but we are not actually giving or refusing or asking for it, we can use can or can't, or be allowed to. Look at the example. The students can choose any topic for their project. So here we're talking about permission, but we're not asking for permission, right? So we're just telling people that they are able to do it, right? So we can't, it in the library, no permission. You, we can't eat in the library. The librarian will say, hey, guys, go out if you want to eat. You cannot eat in the library, right? It is forbidden. So there is no permission to eat in the library. Are we allowed to smoke in these restaurants? Mm, no, you're not allowed to eat in, uh, to, to, to smoke. It is open to the public. You know, public areas, mm -mm, you cannot smoke, right? 
are we allowed to allow be allowed to you already know this uh, structure because we have used it before and check that when we use be allowed to we are also talking about permission right and then you say will journalists be allowed to ask questions yeah journalists will be allowed to ask questions right journalists can ask questions yeah so here we're talking about permission will you let them ask for permissions yes we will let them they can do it they are allowed to do it that means they are it is permitted it is permitted for them to ask for permissions or for us uh, for us questions okay now we also a part of 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 a uh, may use being used for permission we may have may and might right uh, remember may can be used for permission but also for possibility and tomorrow we will be talking about that might when talking about possibility has the same meaning as may but might cannot be used for permission. For permission, we use may, can, and could, right? And when talking about possibility, we can use may, we can use might, and we can use could also. It could be. Um, for example, if we say, would it be possible? Yeah, it could be possible. So there is a possibility, we say. <laughs> May expresses a greater degree of certainty. So it is very possible, right? We use may. It is very possible, but not at 100%. You should ask him, he may or might not know Susan's telephone number. Perhaps he knows her number. Perhaps it means maybe. Maybe he knows his, her number. I may see you later, or I might see you later. Perhaps I will see you later. So there is a possibility that I see you later. You should introduce yourself. He may not remember you, or he might not remember you. Here, you say, well, there is a big probability that he doesn't remember you. Tell me, Ceci. Miss, ¿qué significa Karel y Gre? Mm? ¿Qué significa? Bueno, ¿qué quiere decir en español? Gre? Gre. Uh -huh. En algo de degree. Degree. Uh -huh. en, yes. en un gran grado. Es este, cuando decimos de que may expresses a greater degree of certainty, es que es muy, muy, muy posible. Muy posible. May. Una alta posibilidad, digamos. Una gran posibilidad. Uh -huh. sí. De ser cierto. Ok, Miss. Uh -huh. Gracias. Ok. Pasha. So, remember, we have may we said may is permission, pero también possibility. Mañana vamos a estar hablando de may y might. Como possibility, ¿verdad? Porque might no tiene nada más que possibility. Mientras que may, ya vieron, may is permission and also is possibility. Can has more uses. Can, can be used for possibility, can be used for ability to, and can be used for prohibition when it is used in negative. Okay? Bueno. No questions here? No. Bueno. Look at the chart. Check. Remember, we're talking about could to express possibility. And we said we want to be very formal, right? <laughs> Aquí es good. Oye. 
háganle la correction. Estamos hablando de could, no should. Should era el anterior. Uh, the only thing <laughs> that when we use models, remember we all, uh, we use a subject, we use the model, ¿verdad? Y el verbo en forma base. Este es en su manual. Ahí lo pueden ver. Page 42, I guess. So, uh, remember, we have, check it. The subject could, or any model that you want to use, but in this case, we're using could, the verb in the base form, and then a complement. Eh, recuerden lo que les decía la clase pasada. <coughs> When we use a, a model, the verb has to be in the base form, ¿verdad? The verb is in the base form. No podemos ponerle ese al verbo aunque estemos hablando de tercera persona. Mm -hmm. Aunque estemos hablando de terceras personas, el Verbo no va a llevar S. Check, you could request a day off. That means you could ask for a day off. You could talk to your supervisor or the manager. She could explain her situation. Check, estamos usando chi, pero no por eso le vamos a poner S al verbo. Porque este verbo siempre va a ir en forma base. She could explain her situation. We could take the company's transportation. We could, what could we do? Well, we could take the company's transportation. There is a possibility. We could take the company's transportation or we could go by bus. Mm -hmm. Any question here? Question? No. No question? Vaya, pues, no va a ¿verdad? Está fácil. Ya vimos, should, el, el, la estructura es exactamente la misma. Check. What are you going to do here? You're going to read the situations and write a sentence expressing possibility we could. You don't have a car. Someone of your family is sick. You need to request a legal document. <coughs> you feel tired or you feel sick. Aquí me escriben un... un una situation, tenemos cuatro situations, ustedes escriben una más. Yeah, you write your own situation. Y después vamos a escribir acá. Sentences expressing possibility. Yeah. Write sentences expressing possibility for each case. So you have the situations. You don't have a car. That's the situation. What sentence would you use to express possibility using could? Someone of your family is sick. You need to request a legal document. You feel tired or sick. Write your own extra uh, situation and then write sentences suggesting or mentioning the possibilities there. <coughs> Question? No question. Miss, no. for the moment. Okay. Miss. Tell me. Um, but según lo que le entendí, es que vamos a poner go a las oraciones que están ahí. Could. Repeat. Could. Could. La, la could. 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 Sí. Entonces ahí lo que vas a hacer es formar una oración usando el could. Exacto. 
Pero van a ser las mismas, ¿verdad? Las que están ahí, ¿verdad? Solo vamos a hacer nosotros la número 5, ¿verdad? Ah, entonces no me va a hacer nada. Mire, dice, read the, read the situations. You have four situations. ¿Sí? Agregue Ajá. una situation más. Una suya. Ajá, correcto. Y ya le dieron cuatro. Agregue una más. Y después, ya conoce la situation, escríbame possibilities usando could. Por ejemplo, si usted dice, you don't have a car. Well, you could go by, by Uber. You could go by taxi. You could take the bus. You could go. You could get a motorcycle to travel. Okay. Possibilities hay muchas. Right? Okay, Mr. Remember the examples, right? Remember the examples. You could request a day of, hey, you could take a bus. You could walk. <laughs> you could ask for an Uber. You could take a taxi if you don't have a car. You could walk. If it is not that far, you could walk. You could travel by bicycle. <laughs> Okay, so what are the difference? Uh, you look at the situation and then you write the possibility. Any question? Not teacher. Okay. Lo voy a dejar aquí trabajando un ratito, unos 3, 4 minutos y después lo voy a unir para que compartan lo que cada quien ya hizo, ¿verdad? Mami, el café está, está frío, ¿verdad, mamá? Madre, por lo de la clase de inglés. Mm. ¿Te lo tapaste? Okay. Clari Clarixa, no Ay, va pero... a dar café a todos, yo quiero. <risa> ah, ok, está bien, ya lo voy a preparar. <risa> <risa> para, que le, para que nos alcance. Pues oh, sí. Ok. Teacher, una pregunta. En el cuadro, en este cuadro se lo vamos a agregar una, una, una oración, ¿verdad? Van a, agregar, van a agregar allí en el cuadro un, ¿cómo les digo? Un, una situación extra, pero de ahí tienen que escribir cuáles son las posibilidades para cada una de esas situaciones. Ok. Desplegando las otras. Ajá, exacto. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí. Pero diferente a esta, ¿verdad? Al ejemplo que está acá. Sí. Obviamente. Yo les di varios ejemplos. Ok. 
Te hay ubiquense en la situación para darme las posibilidades. ¿Qué puede hacer si se le da esa situación? Teacher, es un ejemplo en el número uno. Uh, uh, I could walk a supermarket. Ya, yeah, sure, you could walk. Okay. Could walk. Le voy a dar copia. De okay. una, unita, unita. Miren, you, ustedes escriban muchas posibilidades, no se queden solo con una, ¿verdad? You don't have a car, so you could take the bus, you could call an Uber, you could ask for a ride, you could take a taxi, you could ride a bicycle, you could, you could ride a motorcycle, or you could walk, as all he says. ¿Verdad? Y tiene la, la, la situación... ¿Cuáles son las posibilidades? ¿Qué puede hacer si se le da esa situación? Yo puedo ir a Uber. Yo puedo ir. Ajá, exactly. That's what I would do. You could take the bus. The bus. You could take the bus. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. You could get the bike. You could start running. <laughs> Así como antes en los tiempos de paro de buses, ¿verdad? That people started walking and walking long distances. There was no bus. No existían los Uber. And it was very expensive to take a taxi. So people started walking and walking and walking. My father, when we asked him, Papi, ¿cómo hizo? Ah, me fui condonando. Se condonando. Mm -hmm. Oh. And we say, well, somebody gave him a ride. And I say, yeah, ratos corriendo, ratos andando. That's what he say. Se fue condonando. So imagine, then you have another possibility. You could run. You could go with donando. Right? So many, many possibilities. Teacher, yo dije que es el ejemplo del número uno. Mm-hmm. Is I could I had a car. You could. Uh -huh. have, I had have a car. But you don't have a car, Carlos. Yes, yeah. I see. You don't have a car. Uh -huh. That's the situation that you don't have a car. You could buy one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you could buy one. Because, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. The situation is that you don't have a car. You could buy a car. Yeah. Why not? You could buy a motorcycle. No, I'm too dangerous. Faster, right? You go faster, but it's more dangerous. Miss? ¿Quién? Ceci. Eh, y cuando eh, no comienza con you, sino que es someone, ¿cuál podemos utilizar you? Pierde o... la recomendación con you. Sí, don't worry. Ok, miss. Mm -hmm. Because it's recommendation, entonces ocupamos you. You could do this, you could do the other. You feel tired. Vaya, ¿cómo vamos? Más o menos. ¿Sí? Más o menos. No, menos. Vaya. Now, I'm going to send you to the groups for you to go compare with your panel. ¿Sí? Go compare. Y les voy a enseñar una cosa más. Oh no, more teacher, yes. Ah, pero espérenme, ¿cómo le hago pues? ¿Por qué está? Si yo... Si no miren. Ah, <ríe> se me fue de un solo. Bueno, 
La idea, the idea is that you don't see the rest. Just this. La check. Porque no quiero que vean mis respuestas, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Cheating, cheating, niño. Vaya, check this. Lo voy a mandar ahorita. You compare with your partners the situations that you have and the possibilities. And then, after you have compared, choose one of the situations, the one you feel more comfortable with. And that situation is the one that you are going to put in a conversation, similar to the conversation we had at the beginning, ¿se acuerdo? But in that one, the situation was that the mother of one of the employees was sick. So you can choose any of the situations. Make a conversation. And cheer. Okay? Estamos bien? Questions here? No. Okay. What are you going to do? No, teacher. Yo voy a, yo voy a, yo voy a pasar, teacher, porque como... Se me quedó en slowly el, el inter. Ok. Vaya. What, what are you going to do? First, compare, compare your answers for, for the previous chart. Compare. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. Compare. Uh -huh. First, compare, finish completing the chart. After uh -huh. you have completed the chart, y vean por qué es importante que lo completen, no es decir, ah, bueno, como ya estuve, ya estuve. Porque <ríe> yeah. la idea es que no se nos repitan las situations cuando vayamos a compartir. Bah, Así si el primer grupo ya uso that you don't have a car, el siguiente grupo que ya no me repita el you don't have a car. Uh -huh. Se ubique en cualquiera de las otras situations. Okay. Okay. Así uh -huh. que dejen su conversación así como un poco open para poder variar la situación y las posibilidades, ¿verdad? Como usted va a tener todas las situaciones y todas las posibilidades ya completas, va a ser más fácil. ¿Any questions? No questions, teacher. Ok, thank you, Silvia. Hola. No, te share, no, te share. Ok, thank you. Vaya, vámonos, pues. Ya terminaron, ¿verdad? Yes. <coughs> Vaya, go, compare with your partners. Remember, more than one situ more than one possibility for each situation. El ejemplo que yo les puse, les mostré three possibilities. Y pueden haber más, ¿verdad? Pueden haber más. Así es que no se me vayan a quedar cortitos a una suya. Bueno, los voy a, a cambiar de grupos. Ready. Asumamos que sí. Asumamos que sí. Go ahead. Iván, Jonathan, Damian, join, 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 join. Iván, Iván, Jonathan, try to join. Casualmente están en el mismo grupo y me lo han dejado chiqui. Hi. Hi, hi, Ivan, hello. Hi. 
Iván, Iván, Iván. Okay. Lo que pasa es que lo que tenemos que hacer es eh, darle como una posibilidad o, o diferentes alternativas de qué hacer ah, si ajá. le pasa cierta situación. En ese caso dice eh, el, el de la familia. Uh -huh. eh, por ejemplo, yo le puse eh, son of your family sick y yo le puse you could buy some medicine. O sea, usted puede comprar uh -huh. algo. Yo puse de hospital. Ah, ok, you could, you could go to the hospital. Uh -huh. In my case, uh, I see my sister called go to the hospital. Que dice algún miembro de tu familia. So, mi hermana. Fue al Exactamente. Entonces podría ser o a una persona en específico o, o decirle a alguien más que le esté diciendo que le pasa eso y decirle qué puede, qué puede hacer. Pues. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Vaya, compare what you have for each of the situations. First, in my case, I, I could walk a supermarket. Okay. Me, uh, you could ask right to some family or friend. Karen y Silvia. Hola. En the first. I, I, I write, ya le digo, mm, you call, you call us for a ride to some family or friend. Hmm, okay. Mm -hmm. Silvia is driving. Yeah, Sylvia is right. But she speaks. Hey, Rosie. Hi, teacher. Ah, uh, este en la de en la dos. ¿Cuál quieren saber, chicos? Todas. Ah. Ay. <laughs> Um, you could you could do motorcycle. Mm, you could. Motor verbo verbo. You could. You could you could have motorcycle. Okay, you could use a motorcycle or you could buy a motorcycle. Okay. Uh, you could go to the hospital. Una number two. You could drink medicina, medicine. You could drink medicine. And you could visit to the medic, to the, the doctor. doctor. You could to visit the doctor. The doctor. Uh -huh. um, uh, you, you need um layer. Uh, because legal document. Okay. Esa solo es ahí, se dice. You feel happy? You feel. ¿En cuál? ¿En cuál? En la cuatro, dice. You could feel, don't forget to use the structure. You could feel happy. You could feel happy. You could feel angry. You could feel angry. <laughs> Como estoy yo, teacher. Hello, <laughs> teacher. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> eh, y la, la que teníamos que completar, pues, eh, eh, You have, you don't have a baby. 
Oh my God. You don't have a baby. Thank you. Thank you. Huh? Um. You have adopt baby. ¿Cómo se dice adoptar, teacher? Mm -hmm. Only that, teacher. Only. Only. And what about the other situations over there? Mm. Me in the in the number three, you need to request a legal document. I write you could search a lawyer. And for number four, you feel tired or, or sick. I write you could take a nap. Uh -huh. And for the last one, you need a tour vacation. You could go to a travel agency and ask for a tour. Okay. By and now, choose which one you will use, right, for your conversation. Okay, teacher. Mutual request. A legal document. You could go. You could go to the Governance office to request. Request. Documents. You can you could go to the government office to Daniel. request the legal document. You could go to the government. Office to request a legal document. Uh -huh. Daniel. Hola. Sí, pero mi verdad que dijo que íbamos a comenzar la conversación como hello primero. Uh -huh. Yo he puesto uh -huh. good morning y el nombrecito. Luego okay. good morning y el nombrecito. <laughs> okay. Y de ahí he puesto what can I help you? Y le responde, I need to, re I need to request a legal document y luego contestamos you could go to the government office to request a legal okay. document mm -hmm. y si gusta Erika nos hace el favor de, de, de enviarlo al chat así solo lo sí ah. para no equivocarnos porfa ah. porque Marita. primero va a ir el, el saludo verdad yo le había puesto good evening le había puesto pero usted dijo que era good morning verdad ajá y lo que como sea ah sí that's ok good, that's good night good afternoon no, no good night sí. Oh, Aster, no, 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 Oh, can I help you? Pero en el chat nadie ve aquí lo que están escribiendo, chicos. La idea es que trabajen juntos, vayan aportando sus ideas y van escribiendo donde todos ven. Okay. Y al final, cada quien puede hacer su propia captura del documento. Bueno, vamos a tenerlo. Entonces, quiero ver aquí, creo que tengo espacio. Aquí tenemos espacio, Rick. Uh -huh. 
solo que como para escribir. Creo que le tiene que dar la opción sino de, de anote. Y ahí le dice, no, le dice anoit y de ahí le dice text. Y ahí está acabado para que. Agreguen ya... una paginita de, de Word, ¿verdad? También pueden hacer. To, to walk, no sé, que le, le toca ir caminando. My car, and, and my car is in start, and I, I, I put, no, but my, well, my car is in start. And the next, I, you, you pull, you pull, and, and acá está arriba, you pull. Aquí está, ajá. Yeah, you pull, you pull the mechanic and you, you pull a walk. Yeah. Or you take, pull. take a bus. You pull, uh -huh. you pull, take a bus. Take a, take a bus. A bus. Take a bus. Uh, take a bus. Okay. Uh, yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, no, I'm gonna, oh. <laughs> yes, I know, but it's no, como se, se pone oh, 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 así, ¿verdad, oh. Oh. Así, así es la expresión. No. Oh. 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 Sí, but it's very far. Very far. Far. Ay. Far. far. Así. Yes. Yes. Very far. Teacher, in the well, my car isn't start or doesn't. my car doesn't. Ah, doesn't. Doesn't start. Okay. I we change it. My car doesn't start. Doesn't. Ah, aquí. Mm. My car. That's ah, it. es porque estamos hablando. Ajá. Uh -huh. That's semester. That's semester. Okay. Mm -hmm. The next. Okay. Uh -huh. La siguiente. Mm. Yes. I know, but it's very far. And I know, but you. Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know, no, o sí. Sí, pero sería, o sea, ¿es cierto ponerle es verdad o hay is right? That's right. That's right. That's, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay. I But is... But is, is a recommend recommendation. Recommendation. Yeah. Which we recommend it. Uh, yeah. I see. Recommendation. That's right, but. Okay. Okay, um, thank you. Tenemos que usar varias teacher o solo una, está bien. Por lo menos una, dos. Recommendation. <laughs> Uh, and, and case, sí, porque acuérdense que es una conversación entre tres, cuatro, ¿verdad? Que cada quien dé una recomendación. Ok. En, en este caso, che, podemos introducir ahí eh, eh, ah, pero no sé cómo expresarla. Y es, como es bueno para la salud hacer ejercicio. You. Exercising. 
exercising is good for your health. ¿A dónde lo pongo? Es... Aquí, aquí, ¿verdad? Lo podemos poner. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, you say, uh, remember that exercising is good for your health. Exercise or exercise? Exercising. Con ING. Remember that exercising is good for your health. Is good for your health. Oh. Yeah. Remember that exercising is good for you, for your health. La siguiente la tendríamos que cambiar. That's right. That's right. Esa última. Ajá. No, no sé, porque si le, pusimos, si le ponemos que es for two heads, eh, le podríamos poner ahí exercising is good for two heads. Um, No sé cómo le podríamos poner exchange for your health. ¿Cómo le podríamos agregar entonces? Es que otra. That's right, but in this case, mm. Mm. otra recomendación podríamos ponerla ahí, pero no sé. Ay. Um, no sé si le ponemos aquí. Uh -huh. que, que igual que al final del día se siente cansado de tanto caminar, digamos, por andar en, en bus, ¿verdad? Y uh -huh. le puede decir el otro, debería de descansar, o sea, como otra recomendación. Take a rest, ajá, ok. You should take a rest. Ajá, entonces sería aquí como... La vamos a poner igual, that's right. Vamos a cambiar, esta la vamos a quitar. The... Uh, I I feel I feel uh, I feel uh, very uh, I feel very tired in at night. Very tired. I'm at night. At night. Uh -huh. The other recommendations. Yes, but you. Yes, you. Yes, you could. Uh, you could. Mm -hmm. You could take, rest. Take a rest. You take a rest. You take. You only you. You take a rest. You could take a rest. You could take a rest. Take a rest. Okay. Okay. okay thank you. Okay. Yeah, oh yes, absolutely. Yes. Okay. 
Okay, thank you for your help. <laughs> your, your recommendation. Yeah, I think it was a recommendation. Thanks for you. Thank you for your help. For your help. Your help. 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 H L H E L P. F L I. Perdón, me la escuché. Help. Thank you for your help. Ahorita. <laughs> Help. Help. Thank you for your help. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. What? Okay. 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 And then next. Aquí. Yeah, Para que. Bye. Hoy. You will. Hoy. Hoy say the, the roles. Welcome. Así es. Hay que ver quién es quién para poder practicar uh -huh. y así poder decirla. Porque sí está la participación de los tres. Uh -huh. No, hey. no pone guys. Uh -huh. No se vea tan, tan así. Bye. Carlos. Hola. Do you want to, to see? A, B, or C? Mm, no, cualquiera, les no sé si hay. Es... <risa> 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 Bueno. Si quiere, Sandra, usted sea uh -huh. la A, yo la B y Carlos el C. Ok. Perfecto. Y la letra chiquitita sí. está ahí, okay. más sí. que otra cosa. Muy pequeña la letra, dice. The letter is very small. Sí. Very small. Se lo copio aquí en el chat si quieren yes. para, que, para que lo tengan también. Lo que pasa es que cuando nos cambiemos al otro, se va a perder. Lo voy a copiar yo en Word. O otra en la captura. No le puedo tomar captura. O lo comparte cuando estemos. Si quiere, practiquemos. Vale, dale. Yo lo tengo en Word. No sé si... El... Lo puedo comparto la pantalla yo, no sé. Vale, vea. Sí, está bien. Ajá. Practiquemos. Ah, pero tendría que dejar de, de compartir este. Sí. Sí. A ver, Carlos, hoy sí lo puede compartir. Sí. Sí, en el no está en este nada más. Pero ah, okay. Hi, Miss. English in English, vamos. Okay. <laughs> Your champions, come on. Miss, es que siento que se me está olvidando el español, sí. Ah, es de lo que olvidando. Pero lo practicamos. ¿eh? <laughs> ah, sí. Ajá. No hay que olvidar nuestras raíces. <laughs> Ah, ¿Quién diría? <risa> no, si vamos. preguntando pues, cómo se dice en español, eh, eh, y ahí estábamos ah, en eso. <risa> Vaya, ya hicimos el dialoguito y todo, ya solo esperando. No lo hicimos muy extenso como para darle chance a los otros grupos. Ok. Pero ya ya estamos listos entonces. Sí, a su yes. señal. Ok, very good. Vámonos, pues, que solo que vengo a ver. Ay, un zancudo ingrato esto. Qué 
lo podemos ya. hacer, Manuel, es practicarlo. Sí, practice. Practice it one last time. Vaya, Manuel, vaya, Silvia. Ok. Inicia, Manuel. Ajá. No, porque vos y yo lo hicimos, Luis, Silvia y Juan, que lo hagan. Bueno, pero ¿quién sí, inicia? Claro. La cosa es que inicia un compañero. Ah, vaya, que inicie bueno, Juan. Vaya, voy a iniciar yo, quiero ver. No, dale. Good evening. ¿Quién, quién iba a iniciar? Usted. Oh. Ah, ok. Good evening. How are you? Good pero evening, ahí Manuel. Pero ahí está el diálogo. Good evening, Manuel. Uh, I feel worried. No, um, no, 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 me perdí. Ahí pero... está el diálogo, solo lean. Cuando dice Manuel, vas a leer tú, Juan. Y si sí. yo leer tal cual. Ok. Ajá. Ay, que leí abajo. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, Manuel. I am Phil. Póngale, Billy, vamos. How are you? Como que le alegran a verlo. Creo que no entendido. Vaya, dale, Manuel. Good evening, Luis. How are you? Uh, good evening, Manuel. I feel worried. Why? Are you worried? Because my dog is sick and it's a long old day. You would ask for permission to take him to the bed. It's great. Thanks for the recommendation. Sure, no problem. See you later. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Hey. Rápido y furioso nosotros. <risa> Vaya, pero, pero, pero. Eh, Oye, lo, yo, otro, ya, él va Manuel otro con Silvia. Vaya, Silvia. Usted con Manuel, porque así se, se planeó todo para que tenga sabor la conversación. Good evening, Silvia. How are you? Good evening, Manuel. I feel worried. Why? Are you worried? Because Ay, my dog exceeds and it is alone all day. You would ask for permission to take him to the bed. It is great that uh, thank you for the recommendation. It is sure, great. no problem. See you later. See you soon. Excuse me, teacher. Great. 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 Something. Vaya, let's see who will be my first volunteer. Volunteer, volunteer, volunteer. O victim. We teacher Rosie and I, Karen. Okay, good. Okay. 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 Hello, Rosie. Hi, Karen. How are you? I'm okay, but can you come to my house? I need your help right now. No, I can't go right now because I don't have my car. But you could take a bus. <laughs> no. no, the bus station is far away to my house. Okay. Also, you could call an Uber. Oh, yes, it's a bit idea. I ask an Uber right now. Thank you. See you soon. See you there. Great, great. Very good, chicas. Okay, let's see who will be the next one. Teacher, with I group. You. Jo Erika, Joanna, with who? With Daniel, Clarissa, 
Hello. 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 Good morning, Erika. What can I help you? I need to request a legal document. Okay, you could go to the government office to request the legal document. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Just a teacher. Excellent, thank you. Let's see, that was group number one and number two. We're missing group three and four. Claudia, Isaiah, Sandra, and Carlos. Yes. Go, 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 go. Vamos a compartir la pantalla. Eso. Nice. Hello. Good morning, guys. How are you? Hi, I'm fine, but I don't have a car. Really? Why? Well, my car doesn't start. You call, call a mechanic, I, you call, pay a bus. Ah, oh, yes, I know, but, I, but it's very far. Exactly, it's going for you and her. <laughs> That's right, but I feel very tired at night. <laughs> yes, you call Thai Arras. You're welcome. Okay, thanks for your help. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs> Carlos, yeah. ¿qué pasó, Carlos? Tenemos que hacerlo. You're welcome. <laughs> Carlos. Okay, very good. Qué malo, Carlos. Excellent <laughs> for you. Okay, let's see the last group. Uh, Ivan, Juan, Antonio, Luis Enrique, y Manuel. ¿Y quién más estaba allí? Silvia. Oh, Silvia, Silvia Inés. Hello, Pes. Sí. Okay, vaya. Okay. Good evening, Silvia. How are you? Good evening, Manuel. I'm feeling warm. Why? Are you worried? Because my dog is sick and it is alone all day. You would ask for permission to take him to the bed. It's great. Thanks for the recommendation. Yeah. Sure, no problem. See you later. I see you soon. See you soon. Thank you. Thank if you. the boss loves animals, he will say, sure. Okay, go, Silvia. Go with, with your pet. But if the boss doesn't like animals, he will say, Ay, de hello. Nah. Right? So it depends on the boss. Okay. Have you ever asked for permission for a pet? No, never. Never, never, never. No, I don't have pets. You don't have pets? I have a, I no. have a lot of cats. When well, no, I have two cats. Two cats. No. They are meow, meow, meow. Sometimes <laughs> they come to class. Today, I had, a, I had a cat here on my desk all afternoon in the class that I give in the afternoon. She was here over the book. I wanted to take a picture of the page that the children were going to do for homework and the cat was over the book. Imagine. <laughs> uh, Rosie has cats, right, Rosie? Hi, teacher. You have a cat, right, Rosie? No, teacher. No. I have a moto. <laughs> A moto. Yes. No, a cat. A gato meow, meow. No, teacher. You have a cat. <laughs> no. A moto. Moto o, o, o car o cat. No, este, teacher. Gato. A meow. Se tiene gato. I don't like no. meow, teacher. Ah, pero por qué? De ya Why, teacher? They are beautiful cats. 
Nobody has cats here. Uh, I don't like them. You don't like cats. Uh, I remember I, it was, I guess, about two me months teacher. ago. You have a cat, Jorge? Or yeah, a teacher. Cat, a cat. And, uh, and dog. And a dog. Okay. I have a dog. You yeah. have a dog. I the dogs and one, uh, one cat. And one cat. I have a dog. I remember about two two courses ago that there was a big big cat in class, and when the when the participant was in class, the cat was there on this part of the she was on the sofa, right? And the cat was there sitting on the sofa, and we could see it was a very big cat. It was like okay, about two, three courses ago. So this course, we have not seen cats, no pets. <laughs> bueno, let's go for the last attendance. Oh, miren, que punctual. Let's see, tell me present, right? Uh, let's see, Carlos Alfredo. Present. Nice. Cecilia. Present teacher. Larissa. Present teacher. Present. Claudia Ivonne. Present teacher. Daniel. Present teacher. Erika Joana. Present teacher. Isaías. Present. Ivan. Present teacher. Ivet. Yvette. Anybody saw Yvette? No, ¿verdad? No estuvo Yvette ahora. Sí, estuvo. Dice, yo me acuerdo de que antes de mí le respondió ella. No, al principio no me dijo preso. Ah, pues. Sí, pero estuvo conmigo en un grupo. ¿Con quién? Okay. Ivette, está hablando de Ivette, Joan, algo así. No, no, algo. no. Erika Joana estuvo ah, con ah, ustedes. Ah, Erika sí estuvo conmigo en el primer grupo. Pero Ivette. Erika sí es. Ivette, yo sí la vi también. No, pues no, no, no me acuerdo. No, a Ivette no la hemos visto. La vimos a Antiel, Mayer, el viernes. Ah. Antier, ayer el viernes. Teacher. Hola. Hola. Oh. Ay, disculpe que la interrumpa. Ese. Yo, yo de hoy no le contesté porque no podía entrar al Zoom. Tenía por... No la deja más, estaba en huelga el Zoom. Sí, estaba en huelga, fin, no quería entrar. Lo bueno es que la dejó entrar después. Sí, sí, eso sí, gracias a Dios. Allá pues. Y Jonathan. Jonathan. No, Jonathan. No, ¿verdad? Ya se me están yendo. No me vayan. A mí me no está Jonathan. Yo recuerdo haber visto a Jonathan. ¿Alguien vio a Jonathan? Yo vi que estaba conectado, teacher, pero, pero no, no sé si cuenta. habló. No, algo. Si no me dijo, hello, teacher. No, Jorge. Present, teacher. Eh, Juan Antonio. Present. Present. Karen Leticia. Present, teacher. Luis Enrique. Present, teacher. Manuel. Present, teacher. Rosy. Present, teacher. Sandra. Present. Silvia. Present, teacher. Y Silvia Inés. Present, teacher. Ok. 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 Bueno, si yo... See you, see you, see you. Sandra ya se quedó conmigo alguna vez, Sandra. 
No, in this course, no. All right. Hoy es clase 17. Hoy me cuento. Clase 17. Sí. Disculpe, teacher, que la interrumpa. Y con las tareas, ¿hasta qué tarea tenemos que estar hasta el momento? Hasta la 17. En la plataforma. Hasta la tarea 17. Hasta la 17. Sí. Ah, ok, hasta la 17. O sea, que, o sea que ya tiene que estar claro. completa la unidad 3 y el 40% de la 4. ¿Verdad? Y ya estamos en la clase 17. Estamos bien cerca del fin. Jueves terminamos, niños. Recuerden. El jueves, que, teacher. Sí, este jueves. Recuerden okay. los documentos que le han, les han pedido, ¿verdad? De ponerse en uh, sí, sí. las filas y pregunten que a veces en el trabajo se les se escapa. Entonces, asegúrense ustedes de que, de que les han entregado su cuestiones, sus documentos para que no tengan algún retraso luego. Uh -huh. Vaya, a dormir. Ya, está. ya está. A dormir. Bye, bye. Bye, bye, bye teacher. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye. See you tomorrow, teacher. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. bye, bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. See you. See you. Bye. Bye.